What's up guys, welcome to the channel. And today's video is gonna be a quick, simple, easy video to show you how to replace the rear brake pads on a Tesla Model 3. All right, so doing this video today, I'm gonna show you how to do it without even actually doing it. Okay, so the first thing you wanna do is hop in your car, touch your home button, go to service as you see right here, touch towing, touch the brake, touch transport mode, and now get out of the car. All right, so now that you have your vehicle in neutral, you wanna double check that the wheel does spin and it probably will. Once you realize that, you go ahead and disconnect the main electrical connector that goes to the parking brake by pushing back this red tab like this, pushing down and pulling back, just like that. Okay, so now that we have that off, we're gonna take a 14 millimeter socket. We're gonna remove this now right here, as well as the lower nut that you see right here. Okay, now you have those bolts off, it's time to put a pry tool in like you see right here and push towards the front of the car. This should separate the caliper and remove it with the pads left inside the lower half. Okay, and now it's time to push the piston in as you would any other brake on any other car. However, this is where Tesla differs from all other cars. And now where it differs is that there is a mix here of not just pushing, but spinning. So we're not spinning the actual rotor itself. We are going to spin the motor on the backside. And I'll show you exactly what I mean by that. But this, put, this piston will get pushed straight back by a typical clamping tool that you see right here. However, you can't just do that while the electronic parking brake is still attached. Let me show you how to do that. Now you'll have a 5 millimeter Allen head bolt that you'll see here and here, and you'll have a socket that you'll place like so, or an Allen key. You'll remove both those bolts and you'll pull this unit straight out. Be careful, it should come out fairly easy. At this point, you should be looking at a caliper like you see in the picture above. What you're going to want to do at this point is you're going to take a 6 millimeter Allen key and you're going to go ahead and turn that clockwise as you put a light clamp on the piston, as you'll see right now. And that should shrink in carefully and smoothly. Don't do it fast. Be nice and careful. And you want to make sure you push it all the way in until it is flush with the rubber uh, seals in the back right here. Now you are ready for reassembly. Simply put your new pads back into the caliper, lay the top half of your caliper back on. You're gonna bolt back on the rear electronic parking brake and simply put two more bolts in. And as you step on the brake pedal, you'll see like any other car, this thing will tighten in for you. You'll get back in the car and you will turn off your towing mode and then you should be good to go. Now guys, I hope this simple, quick, easy video helped somebody out there. There's not much information on these things I want people to know. There's more videos to come out on Tesla. You'll see that coming soon. I'll see you in the next one.